today we got an unpacking. We haven't had one of these in a long time. <laughs> I feel it's been a while. Recognize the name, but I can't think of exactly what it is. Order too much shit, especially burgers and stuff like that. This might be Kickstarter related. You'll find out in just a second here. Another person that's smart enough to use this painter's tape. It's always a good thing to see, so you don't end up having the plastic blowing out. From the stupid stickiness of scotch tape or something like that. But we got four comics here. Good thing. Let's see what this first one is. Ah! I <clears throat> can't remember the name of it yet. There's an awesome foil wrestling style cover. Barbed wire wrestling. Style cover, razor wire McGuire. <laughs> the barbed wire shot made it click. Yeah. Razor wire McGuire. Rios de Rinos. Or Rios de Renzo. It's from Kingdom Comics Presents. This is issue number one. Four copies of issue number one. I'm assuming because I don't think there's an issue number two out yet. But yeah. I am really looking forward to reading this, but I can't for a while yet because I have more wrestling stuff coming. So I will have to see what I get. And then, well, within the next week or two, it's going to be hard holding off too long on this. I want to get a review out for it. I might just do this one separately and then uh, show it off when I do I, the wrestling review podcast that I want to do. Coming up, I got a variety of different wrestling style comic books and things that I want to talk about. So, I just, the wrestling comics to me are just really fun to group up and put together. It's just, it doesn't matter what faction, what organization, what characters. They all mesh up nicely. So, look that in the future. But this is Razor Wire McGuire. I'll put all the information in the show notes. So, I can't think of company names and stuff for this Kickstarter. But say it, look it up prior to doing this. And I don't want to get any of the names wrong. So. I will put that all in the show notes. Check those out and you can get your own copy. But this, these are, they feel a lot. They feel very well put together. And I suppose we could pop one open. <laughs> Give you a little teaser of the artwork on the inside. Especially when you got all that awesomeness on the outside. It's like Kane, <laughs> Undertaker's brother. So he reminds me of this McGuire character. But yeah, this looks like a lot of fun. It's kind of like a Mankind Kane crossover for his mask. But, but yeah, this should be a blast. I know I'm going to like it. <laughs> like all the wrestling. I have yet to find a wrestling comic I did not like. I We'll say do a power bomb out bomb. I started out in the hater category just because it was boy on girl. <laughs> but once I got into issue two and stuff, I fell in love with it. So Razor Wire McGuire. All the information will be in the show notes. If you want to contact the creators. And we will get back with more unpackings hopefully soon. I don't know when I got Another thing coming that might be a little bit. Better get out there. Tell the wife to pick up some fun, interesting stuff or something. But it's that time of year where we got all the cons and everything going on. So we don't really need to do our online crap. Save that for fall. Fall and winter. And 
help out the local creators through the con. But rattling on again, <laughs> as usual. But I will shut up and let let you go. Keep following under the call of MS. Check out Crimson Call Comic Club. Rate, review, subscribe, tell a friend, like, help us out. And we will keep putting stuff out as long as someone keeps watching. No, oh, nah, it doesn't matter. Even if nobody watches, I'll still put it out to keep my brain going so it doesn't give in to the monster called MS. See you again soon.